Hey guys, it's Warrior Chick and welcome back to Resident Evil. So I think we can all agree that last week's videos just took a whole nother step in difficulty and another level of horror than we've seen in probably the entire series so far. It was definitely one of the most stressful days of my life. We had a whole bunch of kind of new enemies that we had to deal with. Um, but on the bright side, we did get a ton of new weapons. Um, maybe not a ton actually, but we got the assault shotgun and we got the magnum and <laughs> you guys ream me up for using this magnum. I guess this this magnum is very very powerful and I should not have been using it but I did so <laughs> I'm just gonna put that away and just kind of do a little bit of inventory management so I'm gonna bring this shotgun along with me um, maybe as well as a mixed herb where's that assault shotgun Okay, and there's that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna empty this shotgun first um, with maybe some more predictable enemies. And then we're gonna whip this bad boy out as soon as we kind of start tackling some new area and we don't really know what to expect. So I don't believe any of our items can particularly be used for a puzzle at this point. So actually, let me see if I can reload this assault shotgun right before we go. Just doing a little bit of cleanup before we get started. Okay, so 10's the max for that one. Already, that's so much better than the shotgun. And if they take the shotgun ammo, that's good. Because we have quite a bit of it. Okay, so I think today we're going to have to kind of start switching up the play style a little bit. Um, a lot of you were kind of mentioning that the kind of habits I've been at least trying to form... Um, are kind of suited for higher difficulties. Um, you guys say I'm a little bit, a little bit crazy when it comes to trying to save ammo, and that is probably what's gonna get me killed. Okay, I think there's a. Oh, yep. Okay, almost forgot about that one. Um, and it kind of makes me wish now that I actually put the game on normal. Um, unfortunately, I had no idea that the difficulty went very easy easy and then normal. If I knew that, I probably would have picked normal right off the start, but I guess, you know, we're gonna have to do that for Chris's playthrough and then we can have some fun on hard. Okay, so you guys were mentioning um, that there's a shortcut out here that can lead to the outside of the mansion, so I don't have to keep running down all of the hallways just trying to avoid that damn broken doorknob of a door. Was it this one here? Okay. Yeah, let's see if this leads to where I'm trying to go. I don't even really know where I'm trying to go yet. Oh no, it's this. Oh, actually, no, now I remember. Oh, I know exactly where you guys want me to go. Okay. So apparently these crows, they attack you if you run. I did not know this. The crows have never been hostile towards me, even when I'm it's pretty sure I was running. But they attacked me in the in the the graveyard or whatever was outside last week and I was I was very sad. But we're gonna try and walk and not anger our crow bros because I like them. And I also don't wanna waste ammo and herbs trying to fend them off. Yeah, actually this is so much faster. Thank you for letting me know this. Okay, this is the way we're going, right? I know that we have to Go back to where we emptied that that pool. And we gotta go down the elevators there, but there was kind of a lot going on over there. I didn't even really process what was in that area because I was just so scared when I was ending off the last video. And I was just running all over the place. So I'm gonna try and take a little bit of a more uh, calculated approach. Cause so I think we're done with everything in the courtyard. Or is this still considered the courtyard? I don't know, but what, but where the monster in chains was? Oh, okay, actually, I know what I'm gonna do here. Um, you guys were saying that I'm gonna be coming through this area a lot, so I should just kill the dog, so... I'm gonna do that. Okay, actually, they're just, they're kind of chilling today. So we're gonna, we're gonna leave them alone. Maybe, maybe when they kind of get a little bit faster, we'll do that again. We'll start shooting them. 
But I'll try and empty this shotgun first. Um, and then we'll pull out the assault shotgun. And the handgun, if needed, but... Now seeing that we had a monster in chains and a snake... I don't know what's gonna come next. I mean, we had all that just so quickly, one after the other. Um, I'm kind of bracing for the worst in terms of what news is gonna show up. I just thought this was a zombie game. I didn't expect half of this stuff, so... <laughs> oh no, I'm kinda, I'm kinda scared, I'm not gonna lie, but... Okay, we gotta be careful with these crows. Um, oh, okay. Yeah, you guys are saying that the blue herbs were meant for if you get poisoned, but I guess I can't pick it up. I just gotta use it if I get poisoned. Okay, please don't hurt me. Is there anything in this area? Yeah, there is. Okay. Oh, is that <laughs> I was walking! I was walking! You guys said I had to walk, or am I not walking slow enough? You know what? Fuck it, I'm just gonna... They're right on top of me! <laughs> oh no. Okay, get the fuck out of here, crows. Okay, I guess it's just the herbs. So... That red block is an elevator. I believe that one was out of power, so I think we have to go to wherever that unlocked door was. Back here. Get away from me. Okay, yeah, yeah, here it is. Get! <laughs> Get away from me. Uh, oh my god, I was called them scarecrows. Crows. Go to a scarecrow or something. Oh, red herb. Perfect! I can mix that with my green one, and now we have two extra powerful herbs. Is this where I'm going? Ugh! Oh my god, there's snakes! <laughs> raining snakes! Oh, is there anything out here? Okay, no, 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 100%. Okay, let's, um... At least it's not the snake we saw. In the last video. They're just little ones. Okay. Looks like we're safe. Residence. Okay, we got some unlocked doors here. Hey, let's start examining things. Oh! Oh, I guess I can take that blue herb. Oh, I should probably be careful with picking stuff up. Oh my god, there were so many. Okay, I don't want to pick all these up. Uh, pesticide spray for flowers. It appears to be empty. Anything over here? Nope. Creepy hallway. We got a door there. We got a door here. I got a... Or the, oh, oh, there's something over here. There's holes, though. I can't... Okay, well... I guess we're not doing that. Um, where should we start? Yeah, let's start here and work our way backwards. What's the residence supposed to be? Like a, like a college? Like, dormitory? Oh! <gasps> Oh my fucking god, no, it's too early for this. <gasps> oh my god. Okay, I don't have, like, arachnophobia or anything, but holy fuck, that thing is creepy. Um. A red oil lamp, it's not lit. Oh, do I got- ah! Ah! <gasps> It's so fast! Do I need to bring a lighter? Back here, then? Oh, what's that? Shotgun shells. Okay, I will take that. Yeah, that, that spider did a little something. Okay. Okay, my heart's racing. A little too early for this. Let's examine. Let me take the first aid box. Oh, that's gonna have a first aid spray. I'm gonna leave that. Let me take the red book. Okay, that looks like something we're gonna need. Oh god, I don't want to come back here. Can the spider climb stairs? 
or am I safe to explore here? Wine bottles lie scattered about. They're all empty. Am I supposed to kill the spider? Or am I just supposed to ignore it? <sighs> okay. Okay, there's a herb over here. <gasps> Actually, oh, I can't even pick that up. There's something over here, though. Oh, can I not keep going? The partition is decorated with dishes. Okay, I don't want to- No! No! Okay. Um, we're gonna go up the stairs over there later. Maybe the spider will be gone when we come back. We have a lot of other doors here. So, um, that's a later problem. I don't- I don't want to have to use up all my herbs this early. Okay, let's examine this book. Bandage with blood. It's a book with a red cover. Nothing is printed on any of the pages. Is there a special way to use it? Unprinted book. Um, I think the only puzzle item at this point I have is the, the crank. And I don't think that's going to do anything with the book, so we're probably going to have to go put that back in the item box. I can do something with that box. Can I, can I patch that hole with it? I'd assume it's the only thing it can be used for. Make another pathway, cause that door's unlocked, right? Yeah, it is, so, okay. There's another one over there too, but there's only one box. Hmm, is this one locked? The door plate reads 001. Yeah, this has got to be like a dormitory or something. Or like where all of the, the researchers lived. Okay, uh, maybe let's go here first. Let's get this one out of the way. Let's see what's over here. Please don't be another spider. Please. Okay, guys, sorry. I just need to take a second. I'm just a little bit, a little bit scared right now. All right, sorry, guys. Just a quick, uh, quick little tea break. Oh, feel a little bit better. Not really. I hope that would have made me feel better than it did. Okay, let's examine. There doesn't seem to be anything useful. Oh my god. I'm so sorry, guys. I'm just scared. I'm gonna get jump scared. Something's gonna come through that window. I already know it. Maybe not. Maybe it's gonna come later. Something's definitely gonna come out of there at some point. Newspapers lie scattered around. They all seem to contain articles about stars. That's me! Interesting. Because I'm a star. Okay, uh, locked door? Locked door. Door plate reads gallery. Okay. A lot of, like, little moths in here. What's that? There's a map of the residence. Yes! Holy shit, this is big. Oh my god, remember when I was so overwhelmed by the mansion? <laughs> I can't believe it. How did I not expect this game to just... I, I mean, I really didn't expect this from such an old game, but... Then again, apparently there's a lot of stuff that's been um, added to the remake. There's a hole in the wall here. You see a giant beehive! <gasps> no, not the bees, it's the zombies! Oh fuck, why did I do that? Oh, I should have just left that. Okay, so our two open doors are- Oh, actually only one over here. Is it this one? No, that's the locked one. No, that wasn't part of our deal. But it 
It's not necessary to destroy stars. What about my family? What was that? It sounded like it sounded like Barry. Jill. Barry. Really? I heard someone talking. Oh, you heard. I think age is starting to take its toll. Talking to myself is becoming a bad habit. Talking to yourself? You all right? What's gotten into you? I'm getting you worried, aren't I? But don't, I'm alright. I guess this creepy mansion has gotten to my nerves. Anyway, I think I'll go outside, get some fresh air for a change. Don't worry, I'm just going to get some fresh air. If I'm lucky, I'll get to waste some monsters along the way. Yeah, I think that man needs some fresh air. Um, okay, I'm, I'm not trying to be weird or pessimistic here, but I don't think Barry was talking to himself. I think he might have just been saying that because it's, it very much sounded like he was talking on the phone to somebody and about destroying stars. I don't know. Has me a bit suspicious. I like Barry. He's a good guy. He saved me a few times, but... I guess at least we know he's okay, but... Oh, that's kind of weird. Plant 42 report. Four days have passed since the accident. The plant at point 42 is growing at an amazing rate. Although there are many unknown aspects about this plant, we know that in comparison with the other group of plants, the T-virus has had a substantially stronger effect on this one. The T-virus has drastically morphed its host's anatomy as well as its size. Looking at its current state, it's difficult to imagine its original appearance. Nowhere on Earth will you find anything like it. I wonder if that's the plant that we that we killed in the mansion. Like the one that was hiding that death mass. We've also found that Plant 42 has two main sources of acquiring its necessary nutrients. One source is through its roots. Somehow it has been rooted itself into the basement. Immediately after the accident, a scientist went mad and destroyed the aqua ring. Ever since, the basement has been like a pool. There is a high possibility that it's one of the chemicals in the water that's promoting the Plant 42's rapid growth. However, we have yet to determine the specific chemical. A bulb-like body of the Plant 42 has been sighted hanging from the ceiling of the first floor. We are sure that it used the air ducts to reach the first floor. Numerous long tentacle-like vines are protruding from the bulb. <gasps> oh, it was the bulb that we saw! So not even like the full thing, just like a little piece. Uh. We believe the vines are the second means of acquiring the or its nutrients. When the Plant 42 senses prey, it uses the tentacle-like vines to capture its prey. After doing so, sucks on the vine, drain the prey, of its blood. They're like vampire plants. We've also noticed that it has some intelligence. When it captures its prey or when it's inactive, the vines twine around the door to stop possible intruders. Unfortunately, several of our scientists have already fallen victim to this Plant 42. When we heard the stories from the survivors, they all observed one thing in common. When the uniform petal-like flaps open and reveal its internal, its vital internals, it has a tendency to become more aggressive. One witness reported that if it was if it was trying to protect itself, why it behaves the way it does is still unknown. May 21st, 1998. Henry Sarton. Okay, so I guess now we have zombie plants to deal with. Um, that are probably going to be worse than whatever the heck that other thing was. Okay, I'm assuming this room is safe because Barry was here. Do some examining. <laughs> There's nothing special. Oh, I can move it. Put that back in place. You too? Oh, I don't think this one moves. 
Oh, but it moves that way. Oh! Oh, there's a ladder. Um, I don't know if I want to go there yet. <laughs> I don't know this place well enough to want to go down. Old newspapers and magazines lie on top of the bed. Someone appears to have vomited blood on some of the newspapers. Uh, is that that recent? Is that Barry? Has Barry been infected? Oh, there's something up with Barry, though. I don't know what it is. Okay. Oh, oh, I missed something over here. Oh, there's another door over here. Almost missed that. Yeah, let's do everything on this floor before going down. Oh, it's another bathroom. We can't carry any more items. Fuck! It's a key! <laughs> oh my fucking god. Oh, he's got a pool of blood. Oh, I guess my taser. Oh, fuck, why did I use the shotgun? I panicked. Ugh. Zombies, like, can they, can they go through... Can they go through doors now? Fuck, okay, I have to burn him. And I have to get that key. So... I need an item box. I wonder if there's an item box in one of these rooms. I hope they don't make me... Go all the way back to the mansion. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh, I missed a door. I missed a door down the other hallway. Okay, we're gonna go back. Um, yeah, we're gonna- we're gonna screw these zombies. Oh my god, I can't believe I missed an area. Fuck off, bees! <laughs> oh my gosh! Thought we were done with those bees in that one room. Like, why bees? Out of all things. Oh my fucking god. I guess that's plant 42. And it fucking hurts. I'm so stupid, I forgot that was where the hole was. I didn't expect there to be those! I just thought it'd fall through! Is this the door? I could have sworn this one was locked. Oh my god, guys. We're gonna have a heart attack. Okay, avoid the plant. Oh my fucking god, of course. Of course I walked by it. <laughs> you guys were probably just, like, screaming in your head at me. Okay. I see some more ink ribbons. It's been a while since we've got these. Um, typewriter. So I'm assuming there's gonna be an item box. Yeah, right there. Oh, and kerosene! I'm wondering if I should burn that zombie? Because if, if they move through doors, like, obviously I should, but... There was the key in there. I wonder if I could just grab the key and leave, because it definitely wouldn't be come a crimson head at this point. Okay. Oh. I forget what you're supposed to mix blue herbs with, though. I'd assume it would be a green herb, because just most things are green herbs. Okay. Um, we're gonna put that back. Maybe I'll wait until I get one more hit or injury before... Yeah, we'll refill it. Um, I lost my train of thought. I don't know what I was saying. Oh, maybe I could grab the lighter and go back into the, the spider room and go light that lamp. I don't know if that... Had anything like I don't know if that unlocks something, but we, we do have to go back there. Okay, let me grab these ink ribbons. Um oh and that first aid spray. I guess I may as well put that into the box. Well, how much healing should I bring with me? Cause I wanna go in with the most minimal build, I guess. I can pick up the most items, but then again, I'm just getting my butt kicked already, so I don't know. 
we'll go, um, we'll go light up that zombie, and then we're just gonna do a little bit of running around. I apologize. And also, I will organize this, I promise. You know, maybe I'll do it at the end of this video before the second one. I just, I don't feel like it right now. Okay, so we're only at save number six. So I think I'm gonna start saving, um, st saving more often. So probably at the end of this video, I will, depending on where we end up. Um, and maybe I'll just... Ah, oh, no. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I'm gonna put that away, and I'm just gonna wonder about what to do as we walk through the mansion. Okay, we gotta avoid the bees. We gotta avoid the plant. And the spider. Too much stuff I didn't want to have to worry about. Okay, uh, let's go back to the spider room first. I wonder where the spider will be now that we... When we come in. Or if he, like, re restarts where he was before. <gasps> oh! No, you weren't supposed to be there! Okay, we're just gonna light this. And leave. A strange silhouette hovers in the reddish light. Could it have some kind of meaning? Oh, like the eye? Is that like an eye? Is that what I'm looking at? Like on the bottom there? On the table? Uh-uh. <laughs> uh-uh. Nope. Uh-uh. Bye. Um. Bye. Okay. Uh... Okay, let's go burn the zombie, and then we're gonna come back, and I'll probably use up my mixed herbs, and then I'll grab, like, a first aid spray or something. Gosh, I don't know what's happened to my- like, I, I felt like I got to a point where I was so confident in the mansion, I knew all the rooms, I knew kind of the roots, and... Now I just feel like a big baby again. Okay. Bees, 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 bees. Okay, the red room is where we gotta go back to, so we're just gonna make a run for it. Like, are these actual zombie bees? Ugh! Oh, that was a close-up I did not want to have. Are they like wasps? They look more like wasps. They're not the good bees. Okay. Please don't come back to life. Oh, okay, you know, maybe, maybe I won't burn him. I'll leave him. Just praying that he doesn't come back to life. Okay, it's green. It's just I needed a key. <laughs> okay, and then I guess we can unlock some of the doors on the way back. Sorry, guys. I'm a little bit of a mess right now. So it's just the ladder we gotta go down to. Hmm. I'm still missing stuff in that hallway. Oh, I guess those were the blue herbs. I guess I can pick all those up and do a little bit of item box clearing. Um, I just want to kind of get as many areas as I can green. Just so I'm not, not like panicking. Okay, let's see if it unlocks this door. Maybe we won't go in yet. Nope, not yet. Not that one. Fuck off, bees. Fuck off. Okay. I'm prepared this time, we're gonna take the box. There we go, Joe. Oh god. It's even scarier, because I just read about them, and I thought I was prepared, but, but I wasn't. There's no further use for this key. Okay, I guess it just unlocked that one door. Where am I going again? Oh, I guess I can grab these these two blue herbs. Okay. Is this the 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 item box room? Got a whole freaking new mansion I gotta learn! Okay, so please don't judge my tactics because I'm trying to play things a little bit safer today. So I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna go right back to max health because I don't know 
how hard all of the enemies are gonna hit now. I mean, if they're regular zombies, I'm sure it's fine, but... Actually, I'm gonna try combining a blue herb with a green herb. And, uh, see what it does. I don't know if it'll tell me on the screen if I examine it. Make sure- <laughs> Okay, no shit. I hope that is the right combination I was supposed to mix. If not, it's useless. But it has to do with poison, so... We'll keep one regular blue herb in that. Um, I'll put this lighter away, I guess. Hopefully I don't need to light anything else up. But I don't know what the point of that goddamn spider candle was, because I just went in there and got hit, lit a candle, and was like, oh, there's a symbol. Unless if that symbol is gonna come up later. I'm gonna have to know about it. Oh my god, okay, I almost left without healing. I think I'll bring a... spray. We have a lot of spray. These are also max health, I believe, um, you guys were saying. And I can't believe I missed out on that shot of that regular zombie. It's just as soon as, like, they come in the door when you're not expecting it. Like, I feel like I could have easily got a headshot on that one. Hopefully it doesn't turn into a crimson head and bust out through the door. Um, by the time you guys see this video, it'll probably be too late whether or not it does, but... That room was green, so we technically don't have a reason to have to go in there anymore. Wait, where am I even going? Oh, this is the B room. I don't know if I really want to go down the ladder yet. Okay, let me go back. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Okay, we'll go in that door that we just unlocked. And we'll just progress through the residence. That way. I almost did it. I almost did it. The thing, like, strangles you. Just wish I had another box. I wasn't tempted. Okay. Shotgun at the ready. And if it's something that's not something we've seen before, assault shotgun. There's something right there. Hello? If you're gonna attack me, just do it now. <gasps> oh, fuck, that's depressing. I don't know if that's just, like, a dead person or if that's a zombie. Oh, man, it was probably somebody that was either turning or did turn. Oh. We take the self-defense gun. Aren't all guns a self-defense gun? Oh, it only ha- Oh, that was his- oh, suicide note. June 22nd, 1998. I had to do it. We ran from those things, helping each other to survive. But Robert started to show the symptoms. I had to do it. Those damn things are pure evil. There was no other way. He would have done the same if it were the other way around. After I put him out of his misery, I had to just leave him in the bathroom. Oh, uh, I wonder if that was the one that came through the bathroom. Now I'm probably the last one. How could this happen? I'll never forgive myself for being a part of this project. Eventually, I'll get what's coming to me, though. There's no way to escape from this nut house. It's just a matter of time now. Everything is set. All I need is a little courage to get it done. Knowing that I'll leave many things un undone is regret beyond words. But this is better than just waiting to turn into one of them. Please understand and at least let me end my life as a person. There's a message on the back. Linda, please forgive me. Oh, there at the bottom, too, it says, Linda, I don't want to die. Oh, my fucking god, that is so sad. Is there anything special about this? <gasps> oh! They open up and they tell you what they... 22 magnum rounds. Oh, I wonder if that'll take the same... Was that a 22 magnum we had? I think it was. One brand has been fired already. Yeah, I had a feeling. That's so sad. What's this thing, though? Oh, I can't even see, because his body. We take the handgun magazine. Sure! Why are they giving me so much handgun magazine? I'm worried now. I mean, if they're still giving it to me, I I'd assume it's still effective. You know, maybe I'll keep this on me. So I don't panic shoot a shotgun shot, you know? 
Okay, we got everything in here. Is there anything I should, like, examine? This bed shows signs of having been used. Oh, there's something over here. Oh god, no, he said there was something in the bathroom, did he not? Maybe it's this bathroom. Uh, yep. <laughs> the fuck? The fuck was that? The fuck was that? It's full of dirty water. Pull out the plug. Okay, it looks clear though, and I don't see a zombie in the bottom. Please don't come back to life. There's something inside the bathtub. A control room key. Fancy! Hey! Okay, we're done in here. We can leave. Get out! Get out. Okay, we're out of here. We're not going back in there. Oh. Can't believe regular zombies are scaring me this much. Okay. So the only place that I'm gonna leave untouched is the spider room. Because... I don't really know what I should kill the spider with. I'm assuming I'm gonna have to kill it if I want to get any exploring done in there, but I don't want to do that right now. Maybe after this video. Maybe I'll do that in the next one when I build up some courage, because right now I'm a little bit flustered. Man, I'm sorry guys. I was putting on such a brave face, but now I'm just becoming a big baby. Disappointed in myself. Okay, bees, bees, bees. This is the bee hallway. Don't worry. Be happy. I love how they just like stick to the window and just look at you for a minute. Okay, now we're gonna go down the ladder. Wait! Should I put some stuff back in my item box? I probably should, but I don't want to run back again. I should. Okay, I'm gonna run back to the item box. <laughs> I'll see you in a minute. Okay guys, I think I'm going with a little bit of a riskier kind of set here. So I've got one healing item, I've got the first aid spray, I've decided to put my handgun away. And I'm gonna keep these on me. So we got 15 precious shots. So I think if we run into anything bad, we could probably just run back up here. Um, but I want to leave these open in case we do have to pick up stuff. And I don't want to have to keep running back and forth. It's just, it's kind of annoying. But <laughs> that is probably going to be my famous last words. Okay. There's a ladder here. Climb down. Alright, chill. It's me and you, girl. That's some nice music. It's making me feel oddly calm. Aqua ring B1. They said something about an aqua aqua ring in a note, did they not? Damn, this was under a residence? Oh, there's a box. We're gonna have to do something with that. It's locked from the other side. Oh, we got three boxes! Oh. I have to use the boxes to cross. Okay, how do I want to do this? I'll just... One, two, Is that not enough? Ah, uh, no, it doesn't look like it. I'm not taking any chances. I don't want a plant to come out of there and strangle me again. That wasn't fun. Okay, the music just now sounds 
screechy and spooky, and I no longer feel calm. There it is! That's part of the soundtrack I like. I love the soundtrack that you always get um, with the typewriter rooms. I think the only time we didn't hear it was in that, that cabin with like the monster and chains, but it definitely wasn't a place that deserved happy music. Okay, good stuff. Is there something I was supposed to collect in here? Oh, <laughs> a herb. I'ma leave it. If things look bad in the next room, we'll come and get it. Um. Okay. I don't like what's going on in here, so I've changed my mind. I'm bringing this herb. I will take that herb. Why is my controller vibrating? Is this like poison water? Okay. Oh god, I don't like this at all. Why is my controller vibrating though? Uh. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get out! Oh no, 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 no. Run. Run, Jill. Wait, where the fuck am I running? Uh. Get away from me. Get away from me. Oh my god, why the fuck are there sharks here? <gasps> That's locked. Oh, never mind, it's not locked. Yes, okay. Do we want to go in that other one, or do we want to go in this one? Okay, we're just gonna go in this one. Fuck it, I don't want to be in there. I don't, I don't want to be in there. Okay. This looks... Safer? Oh my god, there's another ladder that goes down. The warning lamp indicates that there's an emergency. Yeah, yeah, I think this sounds like an emergency. Oh fuck, I don't want to go back out there into that unlocked door. We'll do that on the on the way back. Because we're probably gonna have to go back. <gasps> the fucking Ugh. Ugh. This is like Ripley's aquarium, but not the good one. Caution, in case of a drop in oil pressure control, open valve one. Should I remember that? Valve one? Oh, there's something on the wall there. There's a map of the aqua ring. I literally had that already. Did I not? Okay. Ooh. An oil pressure regulator. There's no need to adjust the pressure right now. Right now, we're gonna have to. Uh -huh. I could. Should I take that? Yeah. I don't- I don't trust myself. Okay. Let's- let's open this. Raccoon herb! A mix of two green herbs was inside. That's like the worst combo! I guess that just gives you two health then. Okay, actually, you know what? That's that's not bad. Um, I guess if we get down to the next caution level, um, I could use that to bring it up because that's two points. Okay, actually, you know what? That's fine. That's that's good. I like that. Okay. There's something over here that I should examine. The 
door is held tightly shut by the pressure of the water. Okay. I feel like that would have been a really good place to put a shark jump scare. Like, have it, like, jump right up in your face at the camera. That would have been kind of spooky. A pressure shelter. The controls for the main system. Be ready. Everything seems to be in proper working order. Then what's the problem? Oh, there's a problem. An error message is being displayed. Something appears to have gone wrong while the water was being drained. Oh, they were trying to drain the water? But the sharks. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, let's... Press it. Emergency. Oh. Emergency. Unknown source of pressure detected. It's the shark! Locking all doors to achieve maximum safety. Oh, it's showing me all these things. Do I gotta press it? The pressure shelter is locked. Release the safety. Sure. What does critical 10% mean? There's a control lever for the pressure shelter. Pull it. Okay. Reaching 30% of pressure threshold. Oil pressure loss. Shelter operation terminated. Restore oil pressure, then release to safety. Ah! So I gotta do this one? Reaching 50% of pressure threshold. Please stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Activate emergency drainage system immediately. I'm trying, lady! Water has been completely drained. Did I do it? Oh my fucking god, the stress. That was fucking stressful. Oh my fucking god. Okay. I'm not like that at all. Okay, well, it looks like we've unlocked all of the doors down here now. So, I think we can explore safely. I guess that means that if, if I drain the water, all the sharks are probably dead now. Which is good. I mean, it's sad. Like, I don't, I don't like killing animals. Like, I hate killing the zombie dogs. Um, obviously, I don't like killing zombies because they were, they were humans too. And it's really, really sad. But I really just hate... How the humans, I guess, like, incaptivated all these animals. And we're probably doing some weird experiments on them, including those sharks. Um, but it looks like they tried to, what, drain the water? And then it didn't work? And that's probably how they all died. So, okay, maybe no mercy on the sharks, but definitely the zombie dog. Okay, guys, I think I'm gonna end this episode off here. Unfortunately, there's nowhere for me to save. Normally, I would have wanted to save right now, but I can't do that. So <laughs> I'm just gonna continue right into the next video and we'll see what the heck we can do. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching and I can't wait to see you all in the next video. Bye!